guys, welcome to my new video. I will talk about the Glatov Pass incident, uh, watching and playing a bit gameplay of uh, Kolat. Kolat is name of uh, is part of name of mountain. Uh, that mountain is uh, was the last place of uh, ten uh, ninth of ten students of uh, Ural University. Uh, they were on mission to go out to another mountain and uh, they were led by uh, Glatov uh, who was uh, claiming that uh, he is very experienced like leader of groups, uh, such groups at such expeditions but they come to bad weather let's see intro and I will comment it and uh, say what is truthful, what is not about this. There are some new clues and I must say there is nothing uh, what uh, can be uh, horror genre like a conclusion. There was only mistakes. There were only mistakes, only mistakes and only in experience. So, let's hear what development team have to say about them and uh, analyzation of this will open a lot of eyes. Fifty-six years ago, Russia, the northern Ural Mountains, a group of nine students of the Ural Polytechnic Institute embarked upon a difficult winter expedition to reach the Ototan Mountain. Their journey seemed to progress according to plan. However, on the seventh day of their trip, the weather conditions worsened. They lost their orientation and were forced to set up a camp on the slope of the mountain called Kolat Siakl. It was their last stop. Three weeks later in Yekaterinburg, when their families received no word of their success, the first rescue expeditions were sent. On February 25th, 1959, an abandoned encampment was found. The tent was torn down and covered with snow, with all the group's belongings left inside. Further examination revealed it was cut from inside out. The surrounding footprints indicated the crew had fled the tent. They were barefooted. This suggests a frantic escape, characteristic of people scared out of their wits. Two sets of prints led to a forested area down the slope. The rescue team found an improvised fireplace and two bodies. They were lying in but their underwear, with cuts and scratches to their limbs, suggesting they had tried to climb the tree in panic. What could terrify them so much? The next three bodies were found scattered a few hundred meters from the first discovery. One of them had suffered a fractured skull, this despite no evidence of a struggle. It took the spring thaw, two months later, to enable the rescue team to find the rest of the victims. The last four skiers were found buried in a thick layer of ice and snow. Their autopsies led to even more bizarre findings. All of the bodies had severe internal injuries caused by an undetermined force, similar to that of a serious car accident. No external damage nor bruises were visible, besides a tongue ripped from one victim's mouth and a strange orange skin color. Much speculation arose from these puzzling events. Such theories included attack from the local tribesmen, from an avalanche or animals. Each theory, however, only served to create more questions. The truth behind this tragic course of events remains unexplained to this day. What really happened? Maybe the answer still waits to be discovered deep under the snow. And answer is discovered. In 2015, another investigation started. 
it lasted until January of 2019. Uh, all, uh, there is another source which claiming that is still in progress. But if there will be an, another information, I will uh, make another video about it. Because this was so uh, big inspiration for me. Hear this music. This is perfection. Clean Russian motive, Russian soul. Some sad story and sad tragedy. Really, uh, we are hearing music music from uh, people who made War and Peace, Anna Karenina, and other the most the marvelous things in art. The greatest emotion is uh, emotion which can be said in uh, Russian language. Now to return on the uh, original of this story. This story is about ten people, not nine. Uh, they had a goal to went to that mountain. To achieve their first exploration, their first conquer of uh, some mountain top, but they they went on a winter holiday or vacation. How depends on country where you are. Some uh, study break. One of them get very sick, had fever, and they went back to the city we had seen before. He went on train and went home. They continue their way. Con uh, conditions were heavy snow, minus 40 degrees Celsius to minus 30 degrees Celsius which is really abnormal temperature for anyone who wants to go on mountain and the uh, leader had to know that but he wanted to impress two of girls I see who went with them there, there was a group of eight young men and two girls like uh, they uh, no one of them else uh, had any experience in going uh, of, uh, in wilderness especially on mountain he was experienced experienced like he claimed that leader name is Dlatov after him incident got name and uh, not without any uh, that is not a mistake. He was responsible for everything. They uh, made a tent of for ten people. They dig that tent into ground, into s the deep snow, on the clear part on top of the mountain. When they went to sleep, mass of their bodies made avalanche and entire tent started sinking. 
all of them uh, was uh, were trying to get away and they succeeded five of them had warm clothes others were in underwear all of them were barefoot now they said that it was uh, some uh, force and some unnatural things that happened to first five uh, victims which were founded but that is not true all of them died from hypothermia uh, four of them were people who were in underwear uh, because they weren't able to move from fire which was only source of uh, heat which uh, made them to stay alive uh, but another four are uh, really I think a reason because all of them died why? The, uh, this uh, new investigation uh, got evidence that these four with warm clothes uh, didn't go for help or try to go back. They tried to go somewhere else to make another encampment to separate from, the, from them and to continue their conquest of mountain. On of, the, of their goal there was two girls and two guys on mountain there are two oh, uh, really great uh, grave dangers first is avalanche second are holes in the ground very deep ones which can be covered by snow avalanches or something like that they went down mountain all four of them fall through hole and that is that uh, blunt force which is mentioned in report no, not other blunt force happened uh, on that uh, in that accident uh, I think if they stayed around they could help these four almost naked people to survive they could uh, make another better idea but all of them uh, didn't have any experience how men can survive uh, such a uh, weather condition I will uh, mention Eskimos and uh, I think there was uh, one part of uh, Russia where uh, people also made holes in snow using snow like thermoisolator to keep heat they could dig in or try to uh, m uh, dig out their things from tent but only one who tried something to get that things were lead uh, was leader and that leader died trying to get into tent he stayed with these four guys until their the end until they fro uh, were frozen and died he froze uh, near tent trying to get into it so lack of experience of leader ignorance of entire group made this accident to become true unfortunately for that families unfortunately for entire publicity and everyone who knew that 
group but with help of uh, investigators uh, this became a myth investigators came late they found that bodies first bodies four uh, weeks after they uh, had problems better to say three weeks before uh, after they have uh, problems two weeks after they died so there was no they were lucky to find anybody before uh, they before uh, before spring and now I am coming yeah I'm coming to who are part of this story I must say that the uh, developer said that they were inspired about uh, when they heard uh, that uh, this investigation will be started again that this mystery exists but I, th uh, I played Sh Shadow Chernobyl Stalker and, I, uh, and several other games and several other movies but I always uh, was thinking and I'm thinking that uh, using such things for uh, personal uh, personal uh, tragedies for such games or for something Okay, here is a story about some anomaly, some entity which killed them all. Guy could have uh, some story behind it and he uh, wants revenge on all people who come this place. Classic horror story. And that is what I don't like. I'm not fan of horrors anyway. But I think if you are into horror survival games, this is for you. I am not. The most horror game I played was Mass Effect. Not because uh, horror games are scary, because they are not my cup of tea. I don't like them because I think they lack ta taste. There is only only lucky thing here is that people who our parents of uh, this uh, unlucky people are not alive anymore because they will be so insulted by this content game is really simple I played it like I said for two hours repetitive if you don't have any th that anomaly that is only like uh, we can say looking for their journals for some reports for some other written materials 
in any kind to complete story there is a story about lunatic who fled from hospital that must be this anomaly So he admitted that he was schizophrenic. He was never alone, but he was part of uh, some. He was uh, some subject of experiment, and he became something of more in another dimension, and he is behaving like demon. Okay, so nine people who died because of their mistakes, because of lack of experience, because of weather. I don't know that parents who can uh, give a right to uh, their uh, children to go on a such trip with minus 40 temperature on winter that is suicide and to wait f 3 weeks for them said he had a hunting cabin in the search region and knew the area very well. I decided to use him as a guide. When the rescue team had finally arrived, I explained to them what the unit's role was in this mission and that all discoveries or observations should be brought to my attention before anyone else's. We established priorities, checked the equipment and set off right away. It was not until February the 26th we found the tent that I believe belonged to the student. Initial findings show that the people in the tent cut its side wall and for some reason tried to escape from it in panic. The tracks in the snow led to a forest a kilometer and a half away. But the trail went cold after 500 meters and we had to carefully search the entire area. This was not a place of any average incident. We had shivers crawling all over our bodies because of the atmosphere surrounding us. I was convinced that something more than just an accident had occurred here. I had the feeling we were dealing with something unnatural. Okay, first what can be unnatural about this is this funny report. Because... <laughs> this is stupid. Yeah, yeah. We now have seen one face, good, and another, bad, on a schizophrenic patient who became subject of some classified project. Okay, this last report said like there was a tracks which was kilometer and half and half in uh, one uh, way direction and I'm asking myself all the time after three weeks there was and uh, uh, there was tracks in snow if you go with truck 
in, in same weather condition you will not see any tracks because snow you will not see anything and he in this report claimed that claims that he had seen tracks in snow I don't know I really don't This development th uh, team was thinking only about legend. They found it good songs. They used some things from uh, Stalker, Shadow of Chernobyl, and that entire franchise because they thought if this franchise is dead, like some some numbers, like some secret projects, okay, that uh, concept is uh, in several games and in several movies, but okay. What we... Uh, but to conclude this video, what we can uh, say about this? Ignorance of 10 students made them to lost their lives on this uh, mountain their uh, unexperience their uncontrolled emotions they, w they were so angry when uh, such thing happened so this uh, four went down because this guy made the mistake and they could survive if someone of them was strong enough to get real call, great real calls but first at all they couldn't go this way in the uh, winter Germans are stopped in Moscow because of winter not ten students who never uh, was on mountain in winter no one of them was mountain in winter and but I see uh, such a kind of personalities every day in uh, academic uh, uh, circles I see a lot of ignorance people entire life doing one thing trying to succeed in that they are all they have knowledge only in one part and one day they in their 19 20 maybe even older maybe maybe even 60 years old try to do something new without any preparation any experience every uh, kind of uh, white thinking and they finished on this way I'm sorry for families or, and uh, because I am saying this but this is a really good uh, case how to not think in uh, wilderness so this mystery is not mystery I got this game by gave away on 60 years after this incident and I thought that uh, looking at that background will uh, give me some uh, answers because uh, this intro was really weird for me because I heard that is based on actual story and uh, that is why it is giveaway but if you change real facts in intro introduction you can change the story in uh, some game or something like that but or to say this is alternative reality or something you know 
but I had to know better and uh, I hope that uh, this investigation will give us more detail, details. I am uh, more interested how uh, investigation team from uh, 2015 uh, learned about uh, evidences, uh, what that uh, these four uh, went to make new encampment instead of going to help. That is a really good question. Because I don't know what uh, can give them s uh, that clue. Maybe they had uh, some, uh, they saw some, I don't know, material to make it some uh, part of tent. I don't know. But really, maybe they got lost, but they may, they uh, are clear 100% that they were going to make another encampment which made them to fall into that hole yeah uh, fall was really big and they uh, didn't mention it in the intro because that will uh, explain blunt force that cracked skull they mentioned in the intro is from uh, fall lost eyes from fall from big high hate uh, I'm sorry because uh, of uh, choosing this uh, sad occasion to make a video this is uh, but I like to uh, I wanted to because uh, there was uh, I hate when something is called mystery when it is not a mystery and I want to um, make people to read more about some mysteries I hope that videos like this will make people to uh, read about these mysteries on some uh, channels to think uh, more widely, uh, more open uh, to be uh, to some logical explanations instead of uh, concluding that it is something unnatural. This wasn't unnatural. A natural is going to wilderness on minus 40 uh, degrees uh, with uh, uh, without guide with leader who is who have uh, who had only 23 years he didn't have he hidden uh, he didn't have 23 years of experience he had 23 years of age and in group there was a guy of 38 years and he done like this guy was a leader I hope you enjoyed this video I, I hope this helped anyone like I said who like uh, survival horrors stories and uh, this is recommendation I don't like until next time see you guys